Good morning guys. So today is day three of Vlogmas 2019. Um, if you've watched the previous vlogs you'll know that we've been doing really badly. Um, that is because we keep forgetting the vlog. We're not in the mindset of, ah, pick up the camera, film this, ah, pick up the camera, film that. Um, ugh, yeah. Today will be a different day. We're not um, normally at work on a Saturday. Um, it's probably the first Saturday I've worked this, no, second Saturday I've worked this year. Um, I know, very privileged. Uh, however, uh, today we are um, filming a couple of businesses, um, showing the businesses from their videos, and um, also going to the Christmas market, getting some photos. We did um, some filming yesterday, and while we're there, we'll do a little bit of Christmas shopping. So yeah, and then we're gonna take Monday off instead of Saturday, with the time to doctor to the Christmas light switch on, and what we do today. It is bitterly cold. My feet are absolutely freezing, even with socks on. Um, the conservatory, um, like, is lovely warm in the, lovely and warm in the summer, however in the winter it is not and we're still yet to get some doors or something um, there to protect the rest of the house. But yeah, it's freezing. It is definitely minus something Celsius today because let me just show you the grass. It is all covered in frost. So when Reuben, you okay baby? Yeah? When you went outside for your morning wee this morning you were like, why is everything white? Weren't you, Dan? He's looking for where to see where his daddy is. Oh, I can hear him coming down the stairs now. So, yeah, it is freezing. Watch your feet, Aiden. Never mind, I thought you were coming down the stairs. Today we're going to the Christmas festival. Yesterday at the Christmas festival, if you watched the previous vlog, um, I was like, my nana would absolutely love this. Uh, I've just seen one magpie. <laughs> Good morning, Mr. Magpie. Um, a magpie, mm, one is the two. Um, a magpie in the UK, um, one magpie means bad luck, right? One for sorrow, and if you see two, then you're gonna, it's like good luck. Because um, it's one for sorrow, two for jo joy, three for a girl, four for a boy. Five for silver, six for gold, seven for a secret to never be told. It's an old wives tale, like over in Britain. No, no, no. Are you caught, are you feet, oh no, you're feet on cold because you've got your shoes on. Smart, clever. Anyways, when I was at the Christmas festival yesterday, I was like, my nana would absolutely love this. So we're gonna um, be at work this morning um, and do a bit of work this afternoon. But in the midst of it all, we're gonna be uh, buying a couple of bits and bobs um, with me nana. So that'll be quite nice. Do you nice. want to move your Tim's, please? He's talking about the chocolate biscuits that we both ate last night. Oh, it certainly wasn't just me. Hello, hello, hello. I know you have. If Ryan's like, I've already opened it, I was like, I was there when you were doing it, so I know that. Um, I woke up like 6 o'clock this morning because my mum, she's in San Francisco at the minute, and for Thanksgiving, and she sent um, me some money from my savings account to put into my um, cash ISA when we buy a house. So I've set that up this morning. Um, it, the deadline's already been and gone because this video will obviously go up like later. So unfortunately, if you haven't set one up yet, then um, you're too late. However, if you have, very well done. And if you're my age and you haven't bought a house yet in the UK, then you probably have heard of them because everyone's been kind of like, because the deadline was the uh, was the 30th of November, everyone was just kind of like jumping at the opportunity to get one last minute. So I've just set mine up on the last day. <laughs> but it's done and it's great. And the government give you 25% of every, um, of like whatever you've earned up to 3,000 pound. So basically if you earn 12, if you save 12 grand, you get 3,000 pound for nothing because you've saved. It's just so when like, we buy a house, if we have twenty-four thousand pounds saved, then we get, which is a lot of money. I mean, it's crazy. We get <laughs> currently six, right now we have zero savings. Yes, we get six thousand pounds from the government yeah. um, for free to, for free to help us buy a house. Yeah. Um, so that's great. So it's like a no-brainer. So uh, most people it's, have got it's one. It's yeah. It's basically if you um, if you're gonna buy a house. The, uh, the government will give you completely and utterly free yeah. money by just opening this kind of bank account. That's all it is, basically. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Or savings account, rather. But um, you can only put, you can initially deposit £1,200, then you can only put £200 a month in. You can't just, like, f put the whole 12 grand in. Yeah. You know, you've got to do it, like, accumulate. I can't say the word, like, a month to month. Accumulate. Accumulatively. Yeah. Um, you've got to do it month to month. However, it's really good, and also the interest rates go anyway. Anyway, boring, boring, boring content. Yeah, we just been adults. Time to go. If you, if you watched our previous vlogs when we were younger, we would never have known what these kind of things were. No. But now we do. I don't want to know what they are. Yeah. Bye. Anyways, we're going to Durham. Aiden, that'd be rude. Thought... <laughs> we're going to Durham now, and we will see you at the Christmas market shopping. 
as you can see, it's very busy in here, but it's nice and warm, which is good. Um, and we're not at work, so we're just enjoying ourselves. Well, we've got I've already bought some cheese. I bought some cheese, and uh, Nana's having a look at some jewellery. Should we spend an all of a pension? <laughs> what flavour cheese was it? Cranberry cheese, really good. If I get lost, I'll make sure it's outside the tent. Okay. <laughs> so if get lost, outside the tent because it's huge. <laughs> If you remember, right, from like ages ago, um, we would get some Aunt Momo candles. Um, we're at that Aunt Momo uh, stand, so we've got, we're giving it a good old sniff. Um, Try those and there's, ones, there's some new ones. What, what, what are these ones? These are all natural essential oils made in hand grown pots. Um, we've got geranium and lavender. You've got sweet peach and passion fruit. That smells lovely. Oh, sorry, it's really good for colds oh, oh, as well. Cool. Yes. <laughs> Give you an animal smell. That's peppermint. Yeah, that's peppermint. Oh, I love that. That's really nice. That is nice. So we've just come into the um, cafe inside the cathedral um, to have a quick sandwich because we've been shopping a while now. Um, when we get home, we will show you everything we've got and we'll start to do some Christmas decorations. So. Right, we've had a good shop round. Uh, we're now going to head home. We'll show you what we've got. Aidan's going to take Reuben for a quick walk. I'm going to do some tidying and then we're going to put some Christmas decorations up. Um, and hopefully by maybe middle of the next week, the whole house will be complete. Because I need to figure out what space we have and what I need. I'm going to tidy while you the dog out for a walk. <laughs> Even Nana's laughing at the thought of me tidying, <laughs> apparently. Guys, we are now back home, and Aidan is, t uh, is currently out with Reuben, um, and me and Nana are currently doing some housework. Housework? Yeah, as you can see, the, the conservatory is a bit of a tip because we moved everything in the centre, so we clean all the windowsills, ready to put down all the Christmas decorations and stuff like that. So yeah, uh, we're grafting, Aidan's outside grafting, and we're going to get a move on, and we're going to decorate the house into a... A little bit of a sentence grotto will be better set grotto in a couple of days time, like I said, once I've got all my stuff. It's been a while since I've had these little woodland walks. I've missed them, because the last time I did it was in Vlogtober. And now, sorry, I've got, while I'm talking here, I've also got to watch me dog doesn't go into a stream. Uh, <laughs> so, this is the first of the woodland walks of, uh, of Vlogmas. And if you can see, but you can't see, because if I'm going on that way, it's a bit frosty up on the trees. Um, it's not so frosty here, but on the fields and things it is around, so I can't really see, but never mind. Anyway, lovely day today, and then it's going to be even better later because we're going to finish up with putting our Christmas decorations up and stuff. So that'll be absolutely, it's always fun. And then I've just been speaking to me dad and uh, me, Ryan and his nana are going to go for a pint at a local pub uh, close by. This is a nice stream, look. Lovely that stream. Come on then. So yeah, we're gonna go for a pint with me dad and Claire. And uh, when I take Ryan's Anna home, but this vlog, this vlogmas should be really quite nice actually. We've got quite a lot of plans and obviously it's the first Christmas in our new house, that's a big deal. And um, we've still yet to decide where we're gonna put our Christmas tree because we, there's not really a place for it. Um, also I've been on the lookout for a piano because a lot of these old school pianos are like uh, uh, just getting like and someone needs to just take them for free and they're normally free and I found one on eBay and I'm gonna paint it and I'll have a piano downstairs because my piano teacher Andrew was just like um, send us a couple of pictures of it and I'll see if it's still good because he was like these Dane Min pianos are like really good so I've been um, and obviously like people just want to get rid of them so I've uh, I might need a retune like so I've been sorry if this is dark so I've just been putting it on yeah it's lighting up so I put it on uh, I just went on eBay and I've been I'm watching loads of pianos so you might see that happen you might see us actually get a piano and then I'll learn a Christmas song and on our real on my real piano if I get one in time for the whole of Vlogmas right me and Ryan will do a Christmas song that'll be nice won't it we'll do an actual Christmas song uh, because and I don't know what it'll be yet maybe Jingle Bells <laughs> we'll have to wait and see right I'm gonna put my phone down because my arm's hurting now but look at this gorgeous walk I love this walk look at that sunset gorgeous and it's so nice it's like frosty but it's not like it's not freezing but uh it's not raining thank god what's that reuben sheep sheep in the field first time you've ever seen sheep isn't it <laughs> look at 
how do I get to these sheep? I can't help you. I can't help you get to those. <laughs> Come on. Okay, the house is now spotless. Um, the, like the, everything's been cleaned. Are you happy? Yes, I'm very happy. Just yeah? Okay. Um, he's basically getting his indoor shoes. Um, me and Nana have grafted, haven't we, Nana? Yes, Yep. Have. Yes, so uh, Nana dusted and cleaned everything. I tidied and um, swept up and um, part way through sweeping up, uh, Nana realised that um, one pile of muck turned into two. <laughs> Nana accidentally walked through the pile of muck, muck that I had swept up. So I was like, okay, Nana. <laughs> and she was like, I'm just making you work harder. So, you want to start again? Okay, um, we're now going to get the Christmas stuff out of the garage um, and brought in and we're going to have to discuss where the Christmas tree is going to go. Oh, dear me. Yeah, Nana knows that uh, it's been a heated discussion between me and Aiden no, for many of a week. I would put it there because it would look nice there, but I just don't think it's going to fit. Well, we'll try. We, we, we're going to see if it'll fit where the lamp is. Because it's all, it's all, we, we need light here, right, anyways, hence why the lamp is there. Um, but we could move the TV units a tiny bit more. We'll see what it looks like. If it looks daft, then we'll discuss other options. Um, another house nearby has theirs in the conservatory. I, it's just all, what I don't want, right, is like for us to be down here and the Christmas tree to be all the way down there. So, I know, I know. Oh my God, my privilege. Where is my Christmas tree? It's not close enough. I know, I know, I know. So guys, we have got the stuff from the garage. We've got the giant star. If you watched last year's Vlogtober, no Vlogmas, then you know what I'm on about. We also have the Christmas tree ready to come out the box. As you can see, it's peeping out the box. Um, and then we've got all this stuff. So we do know that we've chucked a couple of bits and bobs out. So we've come to the ar arrangement that we will get a couple of few bit more bits, uh, nice bits more. Things. Ruben, you've been good as gold, and now you, the camera's on, and you're like, "Hello, let me on." Yeah, we just we've got them in the pen while we've got everything out because um, we need to sort it all out. Um, like we, we didn't want him picking up bits and bobs that he shouldn't be. Mm -hmm. So we'll crack on with this, aren't we? Yes. You're going to talk to the camera um, rather than sit at the sorry, table? I'm just like, I always do this every time it's Christmas, I'm just looking at things. You get overwhelmed with decorating the house. You do. It's not overwhelming. You do. You struggle. You struggle. He emotionally is struggling with um, Halloween decorations and Christmas decorations. And um, because Aiden so can't, Aiden can't cope with sh**. <laughs> no, you're sh**. That's true. <laughs> We've got the tree up. Um, it is here. It's gonna go there. We've moved the TV stand that way and Ryan's putting some Christmas music on um, But the door's still open so that's fine and it's, it looks really really nice there because we've tried it out So this is it so far. Yes. What we didn't want was for the Christmas tree because right, it's gorgeous Yeah, it's not it's not like empty tree. You can get lots of naked trees in here Ruben, you've been quiet and you've been so good. I took you out for a wee and that honestly I swear we're getting this camera out. It's like help me Help me! Uh. Um, we didn't want to put the tree all the way in the conservatory because um, it is gorgeous and we don't want it to be like a little bit Christmassy over here and then the, like the centerpiece is all the way over there. Yeah, fair so enough. So we're gonna, it's, it's only for like four weeks so no, it looks it's, nice it's not even a thing. Yep, so we've got all the valve decorations and stuff in, in all of these kind of bags and mm. Stuff, so we're gonna we're gonna crack on doing that now, aren't we? Yeah, we're gonna put we're gonna put Nana on the top. Put of the Nana tree. on the top of the tree. The angel. We're gonna make this angel. Okay, guys, it's been a, um, a bit of a time period. Been a while. Um, the Christmas tree is now up. It's not quite finished. We just put the baubles up, but it does fit. Um, just quite snug because when the doors open, it'll just swing in front of there, then the TV, and then the Christmas tree. Um, but it, what it means is, is when we're watching the telly, yeah, it means that. That is our view, which is nice. I'm happy with that. I was watching Christmas films. Christmas tree's there. It's much better to be there than all the way down there. Yeah, they're lovely, aren't they? Yeah. We've got loads of lovely Christmas baubles from you guys from last year. Um, we're just going through them now. Nana's um, unwrapping them all for us and then put them, put them on the tree. I'm getting all the bigger decorations out. We've, we've hung a star up there, as you can see. So, yeah. Yeah, it's lovely, isn't it? Dave got us that. Yeah. Right, I'm going to crack on and we'll show you the finished product hopefully very soon. So, um, just quickly, we are going to go um, to a pub near me dad's and get some food. But they stopped serving at 8 o'clock and it's like half 7 now, so we're going to be quick and get a move on. Um, they did say that like 
close to eight, but quarter past eight, it's like the total last orders, but we should be fine. Anyway, <coughs> we're gonna go, and then we'll put the star on when we get home. Yeah, All right. we've done the rest of the decorations. Wait, wait. Oh, it's wagging his tail, and um, he, he's took no interest in the um, baubles, but he, he might knock them down with, um, Oh, he's think he's, he, he thinks it's playtime. So everything, like I said, is up. We've got everything out by the window. Um, everything on the um, display unit. Yes. The table's nice and set Christmas Eve. Got a star as the lampshade. Um, we're now going to head off. Um, the clock's an hour um, late. Um, it stopped and that's restarted, by the way. Right, okay, we're going to head off and we'll see you guys there. Hello! We are in the car now because we sat down and we forgot to vlog. <laughs> Really sorry, we just got back in the car and Ryan was like You haven't seen your dad in a while Ryan though, have you? No, it's been weeks and Ryan was like, Oh, we forgot to vlog and I was like, Oh god, we've had a meal, we've chatted and had drinks and yeah. we just totally forgot to get the camera out. It was I'm in my so, pocket as well. Yeah, I'm so sorry. Just imagine five people in a pub <laughs> talking crap. I mean that's just what we were doing, so <laughs> you haven't missed much really. <laughs> okay guys, we are now home. Um Ruben, the little tinker, has a tendency to be really, really good boy. He's not gonna well, I say this, right? He's not going to bother with all the Christmas um, lights and baubles and the decorations. He understands that if it's for him, we give it to him. And we say, like, what's this? What's this? What's this? And we, we, we get him to understand that this is his. This is his toy. Ruben's had a bit of a tendency to chew his bed in the pen um, when we've left him, like to take Nana home or um, we, went, we went for that meal there. Um, so <laughs> I won't tell you how many beds we've bought. But it'll be the last one that we're going to buy him. Well, it'll be so. the last one that gets put in, in the pen with him by himself. Oh my god, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Obviously he's got his bed there. Yeah, yeah. He's, he's got his bed there, next to the couch. Yeah, he is allowed on the couch. Um, but in his pen, we're going to have to just put blankets down because um, we've, we'll probably have it's almost a, a three-figure sum on all the beds that he's destroyed. Yeah. It's the only thing that we need to get out of him. But it's, he's, he's a puppy, he's seven month old, he's bored um, in there. We don't leave him there for a very long time. Ruben lives a very, very privileged life, he does. Oh, yeah. he, 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 he is not left alone, like a lot of dogs are, for seven hours a day. On Monday and Fridays, he comes to work with us. On Tuesday, Nana looks after him. And on Wednesday and Thursday, our next door neighbour looks after him. He's, he's only ever left alone for about three to four hours tops um, by himself, which is great. It is. Um, and when he's older, it's like, you can leave them a bit longer and stuff. You can. So, because they got used to it. But we don't plan on doing that, really. We don't. I mean, yeah, he's a good boy. Apart from chewing the bed. So, yeah. Never mind. Never mind. That's the drama. Um, we will put the star on the tree very, very shortly. And we'll invite you along to that. But until then, we'll see you in a bit. Hi, everyone. So, um, it is a bit late now. What time is it? The, the clock stopped. It now says 20 to 8 and we, it's something like, uh, like 10 past 12. 20 past. Yeah. So, we're now going to put the star, star on, the on the tree. Yes. Right. Are you ready? It's actually much easier than what it used to be because now we have stairs. <laughs> right. Um, Does it fit? It will. Let's yeah. that one. It's supposed to go on like the highest one. Well, yeah, just like making enough space for it. So it doesn't collapse. Because last time it collapsed, didn't it? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. <laughs> Hang on. Bear with. Okay, we'll be back shortly. <laughs> okay, okay. Is this gonna work? <laughs> yeah. Nope. <laughs> There we go. That looks lovely, doesn't it? There we go. A yeah. full on tray. Gorgeous. Looks lovely. I'm just in the middle of watching Spider Man Homecoming because I've recently been watching the Marvel Universe and, and I've come to the conclusion that I'm leaving Aiden and I'm going to hunt down Tom Holland because he's absolutely gonna, gorgeous. Gonna, he'll, he'll never know who I am. but You're going to Ingrid Goes West, Tom Holland. What's that? It's this film where um, this like the psychopath um, stalks it's like a social media star. Yeah, I'm gonna find Tom Holland and marry him because he's gorgeous. Um, and I, I didn't realise how gorgeous he was until the top of the scene. I was there. Like, and I think he might go. I'm sorry, <laughs> but I'm with Zendaya. Yeah. I think he's with Zendaya. I'm taking the Mick 
um, before any of you kick off. Anyways, um, Aiden, you're gonna, um, oh look, there's mistletoe. Um, right. Um, Today we haven't been up. too bad at forgetting the vlog. Um, oh, you've done loads. Compared to the past two years. This is probably quite a long vlog. It's, 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 it's probably a good there's vlog. Loads of, there's loads of footage of this, but I'm going to bed. Yes. So, if you enjoyed this video, please. Give this video a thumbs up. Give the channel if you haven't already. Then click that subscribe and button. And also click the notification bell so you're notified when our next episode of Countdown to Christmas is uploaded. But, um, which is tomorrow. Which is tomorrow. I'm sorry that I forgot to do that at the beginning of this vlog. I'll probably try and do it tomorrow. But Shame. We'll forget. Shame. Shame. I'm not going to strip naked for all you people. You it's know. a Game of Thrones reference. Bye! Bye!